pitching. One and two on a year, also making his fifth start, will be the right-hander, Jose Barrios. So here we go, game two, and Jose Barrios comes out firing, and Whit Merrifield comes up swinging. And a good start. Whit will be at second base with nobody out. He was 0 for 3 in game one. Well, 4, and that loads him up. And here comes Michael Franco. Came back to strike him out, and the Royals leave the bases full in the first. Danny Duffy makes his fifth start of the year and his second straight start against Minnesota. The 3 2 pitch, a swing and a fly ball into right field deep. Solaire going back, still going, still going. Jumps up, makes the catch on the track. Garber tags and scores as Polanco makes third. Twins take a 1 0 lead on the sack fly RBI from Marvin Gonzalez. The Royals catcher, Cam Gallagher. And he's running, and there's a line drive into right center field, and that'll get Nicky Lopez to third. And the Royals have runners at the corners with one out in the top of the order coming up. Witt's double was on the first pitch of the game, and he went right up the right field line. And Witt lines it into right center field. That'll tie the game. Gallagher will stop at second base. And Witt Merrifield is two for two. They're trying to come in on him. This is a little bit of a mistake there, but 94 in the middle. Witt knows exactly what to do with it. Watch the hand position, head position. Everything stays inside. Great stroke. He is a good golfer. That looked like he's on a golf tee right there. Nicely done. Barrios to Lopez. Low ball four. Boy, that is a good plate appearance by Nicky Lopez. That's number three for Barrios. Here is Gallagher, who had a base hit to right field his first time up. Here's the pitch. Slider away. Ball four. I thought he would go with the fastball. I didn't think he wanted to face Whit Merrifield. Whit Merrifield, who already has two hits today against Barrios. Swung on and hit well. Deep to left. That's a way back, and that's a goner. Like we said, he didn't want to pitch to Whit Merrifield. He threw a slider on a 3-2 count to Cam Gallagher, and Whit Merrifield comes up and smacks a three-run home run. The Royals lead it. Four to one. And now this game, too, he's saying, you know what? I'm going to be aggressive and I'm going to be the guy who I am. Be ready for that. Look like a little changeup is what that was. It was a changeup that stayed right in the middle, floated there, and he barreled it. Merrifield not messing around. High fly to center field. Merrifield going back. There's that sound again off the facing of the restaurant in center field. And the Twins answer right away with another Nelson Cruz home run. Got a high fastball. Watch the barrel come right back at the ball. And he knew it. Absolutely knew it. At the straightaway center field. Doesn't matter when you hit it 440 feet. He hit Polanco and that puts him aboard for Cruz a breaking ball and Polanco doesn't get a walk but he gains first base. Nelson Cruz is homered in both games of the doubleheader and he comes up representing the tying run. Now the 0-2 and it's a fastball and he swung and missed and he strike out. Josh Stallman he gets Cruz with a fastball up. Perfect pitch in that situation against the power hitter. So a hit batter and a strikeout and now here's switch hitting. Marwin Gonzalez batting left handed. And that fastball is hit high in the air to right field. And right at the wall. Whit Merrifield is there to make the play. Whew. Oh man. Man, Gonzalez, he is not an easy out. So here's Sano. And here it comes. He got him. Strike three, 98. And Sano strikes out swinging, and Stallmont is tough yet again. Trevor Rosenthal is four out of four in save opportunities. He's and now a leadoff walk. Rosenthal now will pitch to Buxton over two. Yep. Three fastballs, and down he goes. And that's one out in the seventh inning. Jake Cave is the scheduled hitter. Rosenthal ready. In comes a pitch and a fastball is swung on and missed. So now Eddie Rosario will pinch hit. Got him. 100 miles an hour. 
So the Royals split the doubleheader today. Both games had the final score of four to two.